वेलकम टू ई पी जी पाठशाला माई नेम इज़ डॉक्टर नीरज अग्रवाल एंड आई एम असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर इन यूनिवर्सिटी इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ होटल एंड टूरिज्म मैनेजमेंट पंजाब यूनिवर्सिटी चंडीगढ़ आई एम प्रजेंटिंग लेक्चर ऑन मॉड्यूल टाइटल्ड सीड्स नट्स एंड स्पाइसिस अंडर द पेपर टाइटल्ड फूड प्रोडक्शन ऑपरेशन एंड मैनेजमेंट the learning outcome of this module will be that the students can learn about different types of spices their storage and usage able to learn about different types of seeds their storage and usage learn about different types of nuts their storage and usage now spices seeds and nuts have their own special places in food production they all improve food value with respect to nutrition and fibers they bring medicinal value to the food they are the food additives that brings flavor enhance taste and aroma and increase beauty of the food now first of all we will start with spices spices are used in cuisines mainly in south asian cuisines such as india sri lanka pakistan indonesia malaysia and bangladesh they are also used in mediterranean european and american cuisines a spice can be any part of the plant from a seed fruit root bark bud or vegetable substance which is especially used to flavor and colors the foods spices brings an exotic aroma to the cooked food and also promise health benefits today the spices are grown anywhere under tropical conditions and the cultivation of these herbs has a tradition in many countries because these areas except for europe can be found on four continents the most early narrow growing areas has widened considerably nowadays with the development of transport not only by ship but also railways roads and aircraft can carry the goods including the exotic spices spices give flavoring and seasoning to the dishes to get effective results not only should the food please the eyes but should also stimulate the palate the success of cooking largely depends upon the help we obtain from flavoring and seasoning the spices we use for this purpose should be used sparingly as well as with skill all palates may not carve for highly spiced food yet majority of people demand that the food be moderately flavored with the right constituents to use flavoring and seasoning rightly is a great accomplishment the dish could be spoiled by being over seasoned seasoning should bring out the natural flavors of the main ingredients and blend with them seasoning as such have very little nutritive value but are valuable for they give variety to the dishes and have medicinal value spices derive their characteristics aroma and therefore flavor from their volatile or essential oils which are released by grinding or crushing the spices over time the oils evaporate and the spices aroma and flavor dissipate exposure to air hastens evaporation and oxidation thus whole spices retain their flavor and aroma for longer than powder or grounded forms most spices should be ground as required to minimize deterioration spices are best stored in airtight containers cool dry and away from light it is advisable not to buy too large a quantity at a time grinding spices oneself avoids a possibility that ready ground spices especially expensive ones may be adulterated now i am going to discuss about the storage and usage tips for spices some storage and usage tips for spices are as follows store the spices in a airtight jars in a cool dark place away from sunlight humidity and heat cause the volatile oils to evaporate 
thereby making these spices lose their flavor more quickly. Whole spices may last up to many years and proper storage may enhance their medicinal value. Ground spices should not be stored for more than 6 months as they tend to lose their flavor more quickly than whole spices. Try to grind whole spices to powder close to the usage time. Roasting the spices over low heat will make them easier to grind. For a darker colored spice powder, roast the spices for longer duration of time, taking care not to burn them. To keep the spices for a longer duration of time, store them in the freezer in lightly sealed containers. Care should be taken as certain spices get affected when kept long in the fridge. Use a light hand while seasoning or spicing the dishes. While boiling the spices for infusion, tie them up in a muslin bag for easy removal after the flavor has been infused. Keep the food simple. Do not complicate the dish by using many strong spices at the same time. Aromatic spices such as garam masala etc are sprinkled on the dish after it has been cooked. Spices such as black pepper can be added by the guest at the table. Cinnamon, nutmeg, clove and all spice have a special affinity towards sweet dishes. Now I will discuss about spice producing countries. Black pepper is being produced in India, Sri Lanka, Cambodia, Indonesia, Ivory Coast, Brazil and USA. Chilies are produced in China, India, Thailand, Malaysia, Japan, Taiwan, Indonesia, Seychelles, Tanzania, Kenya, Uganda, Turkey, Portugal, Nigeria, Sierra Leone, Mexico, Chile and cinnamon in Sri Lanka, Seychelles, Tanzania, Kenya, ginger in China, Thailand, Taiwan, Hong Kong, Australia, Nigeria, cardamom in India, Sri Lanka, Thailand, Malaysia, Cambodia, Tanzania, Gout Mela and Costa Rica, Cassia in China, Sri Lanka, Taiwan, South Vietnam, Indonesia, Sicils, Kurkuma in China, India, Sri Lanka, Pakistan, Haiti and Saffron in Arab Emirates, Morocco and Spain. All spices in Haiti, Jamaica, Mexico, Gautamela is in Honduras, Cloves in Malaysia, Indonesia, Mozambique, Tanzania. Nutmegs are produced in Sri Lanka, Indonesia, Trinidad, Grenada, Lavard Islands. Sesame seeds in China, Russia, Arab Emirates, Ethiopia, Lebanon, Syria, Brazil, Jamaica and Mexico. Now we are going to discuss about different spices. Asafoida or stinking gum. Dried gum acquired for a tap root of the herb found in Iran and mountains of Afghanistan, also called hing, used largely as a condiment in chong in Indian cuisine and in preparing pickles. It is highly aromatic and can contaminate the taste of food, hence it is used sparingly. Bay leaves. Aromatic leaves of bay tree with bitter, sharp taste, also called tej patta. The fragrance of leaves is more noticeable than their taste. They are used in soups, stews, meat, seafood, veg and non-veg dishes and sauces. Cardamom Seeds of a plant named amomum comes in light green, brown colored, rich pods with dark brown or black seeds with intense aroma and sharp taste. There are two types, green and black, also called elaichi. Mostly used in Asia, widely used in both sweet and savory dishes. Black and green, both cardamom seeds are important components in spices mixes such as masalas and curry paste. Green cardamom is used in sweets and spiced tea. Seeds are also used in mouth fresheners and in confectionery. Cinnamon, it is a light brown colored bark of a plant named Cinnamus cassia with sweet and hot sharp taste and aroma, also called dalcini. It is used in both 
sweet and savory cooking cinnamon powder is used in baking it is one of the main ingredients of garam masala an indian spice mix it is used for vegetables as well as non vegetarian dishes cloves dark brown colored aromatic buds of the flowers of a plant named cinnamum aromaticum also called long used grated in asian african and mexican and middle east cuisines it lends hot flavor to the meat and vegetable stews fruits and hot beverages dry mango powder pale yellowish green colored fine powder made of sun dried raw mangoes also called amchur used in indian and middle eastern cooking also used to bring soreness to the stews and to tenderize meat mace yellow or orange colored covering of the nutmeg seed having delicate flavor as nutmeg also called javitri used to impart light orange color to the stew nutmeg egg shaped seed around 20 to 30 mm long and 15 to 18 mm wide also called jaffal mainly used in indian mughlai cuisine it is also a main ingredient in garam masala and puran poli a sweet flat bread made of mashed cooked grams and jaggery used sugar coated shreds in malaysian cuisine as a topping and in the ice cream like desserts named ishkeksham chili and paprika a long thin pointed fruit of the plant often comes in various colors and contains capsaicin that produces intense burning sensation also called mirch often used after having an idea about its hotness on the scoville heat unit when green fresh red or dried red dried chilies are ground into fine powder used in savory dishes in the cuisines of mexico turkey hungary europe south asia pakistan and australia saffron crimson red colored fragrant stigmas of the saffron flower from a plant named saffron crocus also called kesar one of the costly spices available in the world used in indian sweets and savory dishes and in thick milk ice cream of south asia named kulfi used in indian sweets for garnishing and bringing deep orange color to the food star anise flower like looking dry brown colored fruit with cluster of eight sections each containing a seed also called chakra phool used in spice tea in indian subcontinent also used as an important ingredient in biryani masala and garam masala the indian spice mixes it is also used to bring flavor to the meat dishes vietnamese use it in soup chinese and malaysians use it in their cuisines and french use it in preparing wine turmeric tuber of turmeric plant that induces deep yellow color and sharp hot taste and aroma also called haldi often used fresh for pickles dried and powdered for storing it is one of the main ingredients in chonk used in marinations of meat and seafood before cooking vanilla long dark brown drumstick like rich pods derived from an orchard named vanilla it has sweet mild aroma the aroma extracted from the plant is available as liquid essence used in confectionery ice creams flavored yogurts cakes and cookings now i will discuss about seeds culinary seeds are used for making gravies and an important ingredient in cakes desserts and candies seeds provide variety of uses such as seasoning baking and paste seeds are also used for preparing various sauces Seeds are of major importance to the human diet. They have been a staple diet since ancient times. They are excellent source of protein and contain essential amino acids lysine which is deficient in cereals. Thus, 
Pulses consumed in conjunction with cereals achieve a full complement of amino acids. They are rich in complex carbohydrates, vitamin B and some essential minerals. Unlikely seeds with some notable exception, pulses contain a little amount of fat. Some pulses contain anti-nutritional properties and toxic substances, many of which can be denatured by proper cooking. Now, I will discuss about uh, different types of seeds. The following seeds are generally used for culinary purpose. Caraway, it's dark brown, 3-4 mm long, ridged grain, also called shahajira. They are often used for seasoning. Serbia, used to sprinkle on breads. In India, used in rice dishes. In Europe, used in cake. In Middle East, used in caraway pudding. Second is carom or royal cumin, grayish brown colored, 2 mm long, pointed oval shaped, ridged and spicy seeds also known as ajwan, mostly used in India in seasonings to bring flavors to the food. Because of hot taste cannot be consumed raw. It is often paired with lentils and beans to reduce gaseous effects. Coriander, yellowish green colored, oval round, 3 to 4 mm long, 2 to 3 mm diameter of seeds, also called dhania seeds, used roasted and powdered as flavorful condiments in Indian, Pakistani, Sri Lankan and Bangladeshi cuisines. Cumin, light brown colored, 2 to 4 mm long, rich seeds, also called jeera. In India, they are roasted and powdered and used in tangy foods to enhance flavor. It is also one of the five ingredients of chonk. It is also used in curd-based salads and other Indian cuisines. Fennel, grey, olive green colored, 3 to 4 mm long, 1 to 2 mm wide, ridged, sweet and spicy seeds, also called sauf, mostly used for flavoring all over the world, used in Italian sausages, risotto and Indian gravies from Gujarat and Kashmir. Eastern Indian states use it in five spices mix called panchpuran. It is consumed as after meal digestive and mouth freshener. Fenugreek, dark yellow colored, twisted, slender shape, matte finished, two to three millimeter long seeds, also called methi dana. Sprouted seeds and microgreens are used in Indian salads named Pachhari, also used on chonk, powdered fenugreek. Seeds are used in crispy tea time, Indian snacks called matri. Flax, dark brown or yellow glossy, oval shaped, pointed at an end, 3 to 4 mm long, flat seeds, also called alsi. In India, they are roasted and powdered with paprika and salt to be eaten with boiled rice, contain high amount of omega-3 fatty acids often sprinkled on wheat breads. Mustard, black, brown, white, with husk and dark yellow, without it, round seeds of 2 mm diameter, also called sarso, used as a main ingredient in chonk. Mustard leaves are used in vegetable preparation or stews in North India. Its oil is used in cooking and pickles. Europe used it in sauces, mustard sauce. Nigella, black seeds of 1 to 2 mm length, also called kalonji, used in cooking, flat bread in North Indian cuisine, also used as a part of gravies, pulses and curries in India and Middle East, used in preparing Armenian string cheese. Pomegranate, Pale red, brown colored, dried seeds with juicy coat that brings tangy taste, also called anardana. Dried seeds are used as an acidic agent for chutney and curry preparations in Indian and Pakistani cuisines. Used fresh in salads and food garnishing. Used dried or powdered in preparing syrups and spreads. Poppy seeds, small creamy white or black colored kidney-shaped seeds of 1 mm size, 
also called khaskas, used as pastry filling when powdered and pasted with milk, sprinkled on breads and cakes. It is used in preparing gravies and sweet breads in Indian cuisine. Pumpkin, creamy white with husk and light green, meat inside, flat oval shaped, 6 to 8 mm long, pointed seeds, used extensively in US, Mexico, Europe and Africa as a roasted snacks or in cooking. Sesame, light brown color, 2 to 3 mm long, 2 mm wide, oval shaped, pointed flat grains, also called till. They are used as toppings on buns and breads. Japan, unhusked seeds are used in gumashio, a seasoning for rice. In India, roasted seeds are mixed with jaggery, rolled into balls or stuffed in flat bread, mixed with paprika to make malagai. Watermelon, black or brown colored, oval shaped, flat seeds when unhusked, creamy white when husked. They are used for garnishing cakes and breads in salads and preparing white gravies. Now, I am going to discuss about nuts. Nuts are the edible seeds covered with hard kernel. They are used in preparing gravies, salads and sauces. They are an important ingredient in cakes, desserts, chocolates, ice creams and confectionery. Nuts have high amount of oils and high fat contents. Now, I am going to discuss about different type of nuts. Almond, cream colored with shell and deep brown, without shell, oval shaped, flattish nut, also called badam. Can be consumed, roasted, salted or spicy as a snack. They are blanched to remove the coat and are used in Indian royal gravies and biryanis. Also used on faluda, a desert made of vermicelli cooked in milk and shrikhand, a desert made of hung curds. Used as an additive to cereal, cakes, ice creams and pastries. Greece, they use this in wedding sweet called amyglotta. Iran, sea salt dipped and dried almonds are consumed as snacks. And in India, used extensively in Mughlai cuisine. In Italy, they prepare almond macaroons. The second nut is cashew, light brown with coat and creamy white colored without coat. Kidney shaped nut also called kaju. Consumed, roasted, plain, salted or spiced as snack. Also used in preparing kaju katli, a desert made of cooking cashew powder in milk and sugar. In India, cashew powder is used as a base of various sweets and desserts named like suji halwa and modak used in gravies and curries such as khoya kaju and kaju usal and also used in preparing cashew vinegar and feni and alcohol chestnut green hairy shell outside and dark brown glossy half onion shaped nut from inside dried and milled into flour to add into breads pancakes pasta and polenta. Used as a thickening agent in soups and sauces, can be eaten candied, boiled, steamed, deep fried, grilled or roasted. In Croatia, they use in fritters, Hungary, they use in deserts named Gets Swiss along with Kish used to make a desert called vermicelli. Coconut, green when tender, brown when ripe, two shells outer with coir, Inner very tough kernel, bigger than tennis balls without outer shell, filled with sweet water. White fruit meat is seen when broken, also called nariel. Coconut is grated, dried and powdered to use as ingredient in cakes, Swiss rolls and biscuits. Also used for preparation, presentation of food. In India, it has been used in preparing sweets called coconut burfi and modak, also used in gravies and chutneys, the top made of grated fresh coconut with herbs and chili ground to paste. Hazelnut, onion shaped, reddish brown, hard outer shell, light brown fruit, used in pralines and chocolates, also used in chocolate truffles, Nutella chocolate spread 
and Frangico liqueur. Hazelnut oil is also used as a cooking oil. Macedema, milk chocolate colored shell of around 3 cm diameter with a white spherical speed seed of 1 inches. Used as a filler and flavor enhancer in minced meat, poultry and seafood preparations. Used powder nuts in pastry or as a topping of pies. Roasted nuts yield a strong flavor. Its oil is used as salad dressing. Peanut, light brown, ridged, thin shell contain 1 to 4 peanuts. Light pink or deep crimson pink nuts inside arranged in a row, also called ground nuts. Used in peanut butter spread, they can be consumed raw, roasted, spiced or salted as snack. First, press oil is used in cooking. In India, it is used as an important ingredient in sabudana khichdi, a snacks made of soaking sago and chikki, a sweet toffee. They are added to snacks named poha and chivra, the wet and dry snacks made of beaten rice. Powdered or pasted peanuts are used in thickening gravies and chutneys. Pistachio, creamy white smooth and hard shell containing light olive green and violet colored seed meat inside, also called pista. Used for presenting Mughal sweets such as halwa, finni, faluda and sheer kurma. Also used ground in Indian poppy sickle made of thick milk and sugar called kulfi. Walnut, spherical heart and rough shell of around 3 cm diameter, dark brown brain shaped nut meat inside. Used chopped in cakes, cookies, pralines, pie toppings and brownies. Halves are used for salads, dressings and food presentations. Middle East cuisines used it in the preparation of chicken and Italy it is used in pesto sauce. Now I am going to summarize this module. Seeds, nuts, herb and spices have their own special places in food production. They all improve food value with respect to nutrition and fibers. They bring medicinal value to the food. They are the food additives that brings flavors, enhances taste and aroma and increase beauty of the food. Thanking you and have a nice day.